bless us. He'll bless us. Well, you go your way, and I go mine. Now and forever till the end of time, I find somebody new, and baby, we'll say we're through, and you won't matter anymore. Boom, 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 you know, you boom, probably boom. think that's a Buddy Holly song. I do. Paul Anker wrote that song. What? Canadian boy. Yep. Wow. From the East. We got Paul Anka to thank us. He's still kicking ass, too. He's about, I don't know. 143? I don't want. He's still alive, so I don't want to bug him. <laughs> Tristan said. But I heard that real old guy the other day. He said, not 93. <laughs> no, not. He said, not old. Yeah. He said, 87. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty sad. Tristan was saying last night. He keeps checking to see if Jimmy Carter's still alive. And he always is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, uh, yeah, he's, uh, <laughs> Okay, hold on. Live from the Bowler Room Studios, it's a really big old time radio medicine show. Three chords and the truth. You don't want to miss this one because you're going to hear me talking about the meaning of life. Aren't you, Ma? You sure are. You're going to hear me talking about the big lies mm -hmm. and the big truth. What? What? Yeah, because I figured something out, Ma. I figured people are not getting it. It's a big, it's a huge. Yeah. You know, to just say, oh, never mind. <sighs> okay, I'll tell you right after we, uh, am I supposed to put this on now? You are supposed to put on your guitar. And then okay, we're going to kick her off. Oh, wait, did I send the limo? Sent the limo for you. There you go. So slide on in, slide <laughs> your little booty on into the back there in five, four, three, two, one. Because we gotta go for a ride. We gotta time travel first. We're time traveling all through this show, but we, we time travel and we gotta go for a ride out to the um, cornfield of dreams. Yeah. Where the old artists come out and request their songs. Yeah. But we're gonna start off an old song from a Russian American boy named Robert Zimmerman. And I'm pretty sure, Ma. That he wrote this song not for men. If he doesn't know this, I gotta tell him. Yeah. This is a song for women that are having, um, you know, PMS. Well, do you know? Because you listen to the first. Okay, go ahead. Do you know what women who have PMS are like? They are like men, because that is when our testosterone is higher. Yeah, I know, but it's kind of a strange combo. <laughs> <laughs> We're just <laughs> You're just not used to tiptoeing as much as we are uh, Yeah, that's what I mean Because I got the upper body, bro <laughs> Three times you <laughs> um, No, I had something to say yeah. Oh Keep going You can actually chord They say every woman must need yeah. They say every man must fall by her hand. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's a PMS song, Bob. <laughs> That's not how it goes at all. But I gotta say, I am in the throes of PMS right now. And last night when my son was beating on my husband with a toy hammer, <laughs> it was the funniest thing I'd ever seen. Was that right after I left? <laughs> I think it was he before. was in the mood. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but don't forget, I'm gonna tell you about the big, the big, uh, big truth. You see this? Keep falling on my ear. I am. <laughs> I ram it into. I can't hear a thing. Yeah. clarifying that one no, no you don't need to <laughs> not tasteful <laughs> wouldn't be tasteful 
You see, last night a bunch of hillbillies. You know, my friends. <laughs> my friends and family. Your people? Yeah. Sitting around, I'm screaming at them. You're all trying to evolve! You don't get it! It's the big, it's the big truth! <laughs> they say every man must need protection. They say every man must fall. I swear I can see my reflection Somewhere so high above the wall I feel my light come shining, shining From the west down to the east Any day now, any day now, I shall be released. Down here next to me in this lonely crowd, there's a man who swears he's not to blame. From the west down to the east. Any day now, any day now, I shall be released. Down here next to me, next to me in this, in this lonely crowd. There's a man and he swears he's not to blame. And all day long I hear him, he cries out loud. He's crying out that he's been praying. I feel my life. Come shining, come shining From the west down to the east Any day now Any day now I shall be released Any day now, any day now, I shall be released. Yeah, baby. We're all going to be released. Release me. Please because release me. At the end of the day, even though I got all this stuff about evolution in our brain, mm -hmm. all together. Mm hmm it tells us so much. It's going to cure so much mental illness and stuff you wouldn't believe it. Yeah. That's how big it is. Mm -hmm. It's going to change the paradigm of all the critical thinking modes. Philosophy, psychology, whole damn thing. They're all going to be sitting there going, Who? Oh, what the hell? What the hell is this hillbilly talking about? Mm -hmm. You know, it might take them a thousand, a hundred years or something, you know, because of the way science works. It's very corrupt, very yeah. weird and corrupt. Yeah. Uh, you know, Einstein's crap, which, you know, is not a big deal to me. Mm -hmm. But it gets down under the law of nature. Yeah. But who the hell uses it? Yeah. You ever use it? You, you use the theory of relativity a lot. No. Well, you do if you use my theory of relativity, you know. 
That's it's all relative to that. It's all relative. It's all relative. <laughs> <laughs> what was I talking about? I don't know, but let's get to the cornfield. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I mean. You don't get it. <laughs> I get it. I hear this every day. I don't want to hear it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, we got to get rolling. Uh, Jimmy Joe's your driver. Remember, you're in the back of the limo right now. Mm hmm. Snorting coke? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Snorting CBD. The discovery of the prime source behind all human motivation is a very, very big deal. Okay? It's a very big deal. So big, it is hard for the brain to comprehend. The big lie is famous, but not, not, I've never heard anybody talking about the big truth because the big lie is a well-known thing. You can read about it in, um, who's that famous guy from Germany? Adolf Hitler. Yeah. You can read about it in Mein Kampf. <laughs> you can read about it in Mein Kampf by Adolf Hitler. And, and you can trust it too because, uh, <laughs> you know, he was half Russian too. <laughs> uh, he was smart. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, his mother was a maid. I know. I know. I know. I'm just, I'm just Come laughing on. at you recommending everyone read Hitler's biography. No, no. About the big lie. But you need to know about the big lie because they're going on right now, in, 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 especially in America. Yeah. Huge big lies. Yeah. What was I talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was talking about the big truth. They're also hard to see. You know, when I say, so I'll tell you this again. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> and you can see how you do this time. Yeah. I'm going to tell you one more time. All right, okay? one more time, and then we're getting out to the station. The prime motivation behind all your motivations mm -hmm. and all the motivations of all 8 billion human beings mm -hmm is that we are trying to evolve yeah. ourselves, our brains, and thus our DNA as in family, tribe, and species. Yeah. That is huge. If you comprehend it, you're going to shit yourself. Don't you want to shit yourself? Because it answers <laughs> so many questions. Yeah, I, I, I do now and again, you know what I mean? I, actually, I spend a lot of time. I've got my... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we gotta take a ride, so finish what you were saying. I, I've got my bowels dream. Nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Never mind that. <laughs> I'll tell you that later. Remind me, and I'll tell you how uh, Israel uh, came about. Okay. I mean, very few. I, I'm watching all this shit about Israel now. Mm -hmm. Nobody knows this. Yeah. You know, the whole U.S. of A. In, in 1914, they were not that far from the Civil War. Yeah. And they had lost so many guys. So many families destroyed. That civil war was bad. Yeah. The last thing they wanted to do was send their sons off mm -hmm. to the First World War. Yeah. But guess who put it all together? Yeah. The English were beat. Mm -hmm. They came over and they had a talking to. Mm -hmm. To a certain group that wanted some land in Israel. Mm -hmm. They said, you bring the Congress through, you got that land. Guess what? They brought the Congress through. They went to war, and they got that land. Mm. They stole it because the guys they were dealing with didn't even own it. Yeah. It's always stolen. The land. You can't own the land, man. The big truth is the law of nature, and I'll tell you that after <laughs> we get out to the... Let's yeah. take a ride. Yeah, that's what we got to do right now. No, we... Yeah, I know, but we're going to put a song on the radio. Okay. Now, we got to put this song on right now because a law of nature mm -hmm. is a scientific generalization mm -hmm. of something, of uh, empirical observation. Mm -hmm. it, it's real. You can see it. It works every time. It's always there, everywhere. Law of nature. Yeah. And that's what I'm talking about. The fact that our impetus of our brain is, is to evolve Total law of nature. You can look all around. That's all they're doing, surviving, procreating, and evolving. Yeah. See? 
Now I got a song that's perfect for it. Absolutely perfect. Okay. I needed money cause I had none. I bought the law. Law one, I bought the law. Law one. I was robbing people with my sex gun, I bought the law, law one, I bought the law, law one. I said I miss my baby and I feel so bad, oh, guess my race is wrong. She's the best girl I ever had, I bought the law, law one, I bought the law, law one. I bought the law in the law one, I bought the law in the law one. I needed money cause I had none, I bought the law in the law one, I bought the law in the law one. I miss my baby and my good fun, I bought the law in the law one, I bought the law. I said I miss my baby and I feel so bad, oh, I guess my race is run. She's the best girl I ever had. I bought the law, law one, I bought the law, law one. I bought the law, law one, I bought the law, law one. Hey, we've missed a verse. Oh. I'm breaking rocks in the... Hot sun, I bought the law, law one, I bought the law, law one. No, I needed money cause I had none, I bought the law, law one. <laughs> no, you were doing that? <laughs> Always the producer, Ma. Yes. Everywhere we go. Never the produced. Hey, we gotta get, we're going up the road now. Okay. Take a ride. Yeah. Gonna, Gonna take, take a ride. I pass a honky tonk. Pass a honky tonk. Pass a county line. Pass a county line. Through the amber waves of green. Through those waves of green. And pass the dairy cow. With their big brown eyes. Through the old cornfield green. Cornfield. Cornfield green. Only Molly can see these cornfield guys. Cornfield the green. Cornfield the green. Who's coming out tonight, Mom? It is. Kitty Wells, Dad. Kitty Wells, she wants Fraulein, Dad. And she says it's in a tea, Dad. Okay, well, I was just talking about how the war got started over there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but that carried through to the Second World War. It's, uh, you, you hear the whole story. It's all, all, all one story. <sighs> so Kitty sees the situation over there, the political situation. Yes. She says, well, you need a good song. You know, make everybody feel better. And, you know, make everybody feel okay, you know. Boy, the Germans were mad in the United States. Oh, they were shitting themselves because they were bullshitting. They were oh, lying they were about, themselves. oh, they were just lying. They were telling, oh, how horrible the Germans were and all this stuff. It's just a, the big lie, Mom. The big lie. I mean, nobody's nice in war, right? Everybody's killing each other, but they, you know, they can exaggerate it, and they can get financing, and they can do all kinds of things. History is written by the winners. Correct. So we're here, and it's Kitty Wells. Okay, Kitty, I'm going to sing an old song of yours, uh, you know, about uh, Hamburg. No, I'm not sure if it's Hamburg, I'm but I was, that's where I was. <laughs> I was over there in Hamburg negotiating uh, on hearing. Yep, pretty good. <laughs> I was in this fancy hotel. I remember that. Never mind. <laughs> I'll tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> Far across the blue water. It, did you move this? Into yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Going to Germany now. Across the blue water lives an old German's daughter by the bank of the old river ride where I 
love her and left her I'll never forget She'll always be my Proline Proline, Proline Look down by that river Each night when the stars start to shine By those same stars above you Gonna swear that I love you And you'll always be my pro When my memories wander face of my pretty Proline 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 Look down by the river each night when the stars start to shine by those same stars above you Gonna swear that I love and you always be my pro line. Oh yes, you always be my pro line. Nineteen fifty-three. That's time travel, don't you think? Time travel. And uh, the boys had not been back that long. They were back having children like crazy. Yeah. They called it a boom. The boom. Baby boom. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, my Uncle John. Yeah. He captured 35 Germans. Wow. Yeah. He said it was really tough. Yeah. Yeah, they sat down and had a smoke and discussed the political situation, the fact the war was over. Mm-hmm. And uh, then they knew how good the Canadians treated them. Mm-hmm. Right? So, they, oh, what the hell? Let's go. <laughs> to Canada? They all keep walking back in. He's got 35 Germans. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's no point. Yeah. You know, it was really stupid. Yeah. Right. They had little, they had 12, 13 year old kids yeah. fighting, you know. Yeah, by they're that out time. Of, they're out of, yeah, they beat them yeah. with money. Every time, they, it's all money. Yeah. It's all money. Follow the money. All right, let's get to the station. Because we got time for one more song after we get to the station. Okay. But, you know, in the cornfield, they got the, uh, everybody's in there. Johnny Cash. Yeah. George Jones. Yeah. Everybody that's working the other side now. Yeah. And they got a, a corn liquor sti- still in there. Yeah. And, you know, corn grows so high. So high. They got a crop of that real nice uh, bud in there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Acapulco go. No. <laughs> That's just an old one, though, that everybody knows the name yeah. of it. I got it in a song, right? Yeah. It's in a few songs. Is I it in a few yeah. songs? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Not as good as mine. No. No. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got to go? Because uh, of the girlies, too? Yeah. Oh, this is no good. Okay. I got to go up Let's here. move it down. Move it on down, move it on yeah. down, move it on down the line. Because whenever the girlies, too, start and get that hot. Mm-hmm. All the girlies too. All the girlies too. Hanging out of the window. Hanging out of the window. Somebody sees a great big tower. 50,000 watts. Station GHRT. Station GHRT. Station GHRT. It's there for you and me. It's there for you and me. Rabbi, Abby, Oom, Babo, Babi, Oom, Babi, Oom, Babo, Ram, Babi, Oom, Babi, Oom, Ram, Bam, 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 Babi, Oom, Babi, Somebody sees a great big tower. Did I say that? Yeah, you did. We're oh. at the station. No, we're not. We gotta go. We gotta go because we, because it's a pull in the front. It's Alice's restaurant. Oh yeah. You can get anything you anything want. Anything you want. Anything you want down at Alice's restaurant. Restaurant. Well, pull the old station there. Woo! Go up the front.
front desk and see Betty Page with your special tea with the ayahuasca in it. Come on down the stairs here to the Psychedelic Prairie Home Companion. A really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords of the Truth. Starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, too. And the Reverend Dr. Joe G, too, coming to you live from Station GHRT in the virtual haystack in your mind, where the show always starts in five minutes. And we don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls. So kick back, chill out, and relax to the mellow sound spin them on our souls. of the singing DJs. Spin them on our souls. All right, we got time for one more song here in the show. What, only one more? <laughs> yeah. Well, what am I going to say? I don't know. What are you going to say? You go your way, baby. I go mine. Boy, you can sing that song in a melancholic way. I sing that song a lot. That's a standard in my head. Is that it, is it right? Oh, you go your way. I, I just heard a girl. Mine. I heard a girl singing it on the uh, Irish station. Forever to the end of time. I find somebody new, baby. Let's say we're through. And you won't matter anymore. What you time ready? is it? Time to go. Time to get a watch. You got a song? Yeah. I've got one. We are the muse that has the news, and that is why we sing the blues. Time travel and muse, a source of inspiration and a means of contemplation. Yep. The common purpose and meaning of life on Earth for humans, en route to higher climbs, is to evolve. Mm, there Don't you forget it. Uh, and you can watch, just keep watching the show. I still miss some. Because the more, more people that go, that, that have an epiphany, oh my God, you know? Yeah. The better. The better. At my door, the leaves are falling. No pressure. <laughs> oh. There? Johnny, I lost my stash. Cash. At my door, the leaves are falling. A cold, wild wind will come. Sweethearts walk by together. And I still miss someone. I still miss someone. I go out on a party and I look for a I find a darkened corner Cause I still miss someone I still miss someone Oh, I never got over those blue eyes I still miss 
Still miss someone. Yeah. Okay, well, now you know we're all about deep health. I didn't get the time to I, I mostly wanted to accentuate, accentuate, accentuate the fact that the big truth about the evolution yep. being the impetus of our brain function yep. is the same as the big lie. Yep. Uh, people aren't going to see it any faster. So you got to get how it applies and you got to start curing people. And that's what we do down here at the show, because, you know, we know when you got your health, you got just about everything. And it is the source of all health and longevity is to understand this shit. It is. It, it really is. Now. Yeah, did I say uh, when you got your health, you just got, uh, got just about everything? All right. Did I say, um, did I say swimming pools and movie stars? Ah, you pee-picking hillbillies, y'all come back now, yeah? <laughs> 